Hey, how you doing, man? Come on over here, Randy. This Randy Weatherford. You want the other Randy too? The Randy. Well, whoever you need. Hey, Randy. He's the owner. Yeah, gotcha. Stand there in front. If you don't mind. John wants to make you famous in something other than porn. TV. Hey, welcome to Buying Your TV. Uh, your name is? Randy. Well, and you own this truck? I do, sir. And you are? I'm Randy Groenhoff of GRC. And you built the truck? Yes, sir. So tell us about the truck. Either way. Uh, it's a 1968 Scout 800. Uh, it's got a 7.3 IDI diesel with a Banks turbo. Uh, ZF five-speed transmission, one-ton axles, uh, AC, all, all, all the goodies. What made you do this? Uh, I like Scouts, and I wanted something different. I didn't want anything stock. I wanted something different. Uh, never had a jacked-up truck before. I've owned trucks all my life. And, Never had one jacked up, so I wanted to go different. So how fresh is this? Brand new. You just did it. First time I've seen it on the road. Have you driven it yet? No, sir. Okay. We may get back and see what you think of it. Driving it, what do you think of it? Uh, it's good. We've got we've got a few a few little things to go on it, but it's, it's how's it do down the highway? It's, it handles really well. Um, it's a big truck and it, it drives like it's a lot smaller than it is. So, what's your future plans with it? Drive it, use it in my business, advertisement. I'm gonna have a logo on the side of it. Uh, just drive it every day. Is what I wanna do? It's a hell of a nice truck. I mean, it, it, that's definitely gonna be in a feather in your business cap. Thank you, sir. Can we take a look under the hood? Absolutely. So how difficult was that to do this? Uh, it's a lot to package in, a, in an 800. <laughs> um, this is the second IDI swap we've done in an 800, so we've, we've kind of figured out. A so it is a tight before. fit. It is. It's uh, best to start out with 800 or with a eight cylinder in there. Isn't it? it is. The V8 trucks are a lot easier to work with on. It. Yeah. We still have to cut a decent bit of firewall and reshape things. Any other innovations? Uh, yeah, quite a bit. There's, um, the grill, all the badges are all water jet stainless, polished stainless. Um, Impressive. The uh, dash is pretty custom and the roll cage is in it. Let's take a look at that dash. That's pretty sharp. So what kind of gauges are those? Uh, those are speed hut gauges. And then you got the under dash air? Is yeah. that the vintage air? Uh, it's the old air products. Old air products. Um, all the dash trim is all water jet stainless and all the emblems are lasered. Very impressive. Uh, roll cage works through the dash so we don't, don't kill our leg room too much. First set of step bars like that. Very impressive. Anything else you want to add? Uh, sure. We can show, show a few details on the rear of the truck. Okay. I would see the the big monster tire and tire carrier. Yeah, a lot of people. I had to rewire it. I had to rewire it. You know, the push button the way it was set up. It's got a rear rear fuel tank, a 20 gallon fuel tank. A hidden fuel filter behind the tail light. That's very cool. How hard was that to engineer? Uh, 
We've got this down pretty good. We've done a bunch of these. Um, <laughs> the first one always takes longer. <laughs> Very impressive vehicle. Does it think he'll bring it to the Nats? I hope so. Yep. It won't be next year, but yep, yeah, this year, next but year. next year. Yeah. yeah, I think the the crowd there will appreciate that truck a lot. So, anything else to add? No, we've been coming to Nats every year. We may skip this year, but uh, we'll but see. You have to because it's on a buy. Well, we we're know off. you're going yeah. a little bit further up. So, yeah. Uh, we were thinking going to uh, to the mountains this year. Gotcha. Well, that's why we took a year off to give people a yeah. chance to do other things. And, yeah. We'll see. And, uh, we, you can't ever tell about us. We wasn't coming right. here today. <laughs> yeah, well, there you go. Last minute. Uh, that's right. I, I wasn't supposed to be here either, yeah. <laughs> but it happens. So I want to thank you both and uh, hope to run across you again. Yep, thank you. Thank you. Take care. Yes, sir.